You've heard about the new Ion S5 system. We're here at ASHD to answer some of your frequently asked questions. Hi, Sohid. Thank you for taking time out to talk to us today about the new Ion S5 system. Uh, so the one question that keeps coming up is, why the name S5? So the S actually stands for three things. Simplicity, scalability, and speed. There are three core sequencing principles here at Ion Torrent. The simplicity actually comes from our workflow. What we've done is taken all our reagents and made them now plug and play. So hands-on time has actually reduced quite a bit. The scalability actually comes from the fact that now, on one single box, you can do everything from small panels to exomes. And the speed, something Ion has always, always been really good at, you can do um, on our smallest chip, the 520, a sequencing run in three and a half hours, and that's what variants being called. The 5 actually comes from our 5 series chips, which is what we're offering with the instrument. Our 520, our 530, and our 540. So now that we have automated library prep on the Iron Chef system, customers who are moving from a manual library prep workflow to the automated workflow are wondering, how do they know what kits to order? Sure, sure. So if you're going to switch from one touch 2 to uh, the Ion Chef, you can go to thermofisher.com slash Ion S5, and uh, you can find any kit um, that is compatible um, at the, uh, products, um, the product selection guide. Okay, so the product selection guide will have Correct. all the information that they need. Yes. Um, the other thing is with regards to Chef, how do they know what Amplicy panels are actually compatible with that automated library pipe workflow? So for two pools, for two pool workflows, you can actually go to uh, Amplicy.com um, and you can either design your own custom panel or you can order our, uh, our new launches, our new panels that we're offering uh, with the Ion S5. Um, so the other thing is, now that um, the new S5 system has all single-use consumables, customers are wondering what's the impact on the environment. So are there any best practices around how they can dispose of them? So in, in general, um, all of our consumables uh, can, be, can be recycled. But what we're saying is uh, to follow e, the EH and S guidelines of your institution uh, to dispose of uh, our consumables. Um, the other thing that we're offering, that we've always offered, is a chip recycling program. We've offered it for our three series chip with PGM. We've offered it with our P1 chip for the Proton. And now we all are also offering it for the, our five series chip uh, with the uh, Ion S5 system. So the new workflow with the Ion S5 system, automated library prep on the Ion Chef system, it's, it's great, right, for targeted sequencing. But for a lab that's new to next generation sequencing, um, what resources do we offer in terms of, say, easy data analysis or, or training? So yeah, for a new user, we understand that bioinformatics can be very intimidating. And what we offer is an extremely streamlined workflow, starting from uh, AmpliSeq Designer to uh, our Ion Torrent Suite, um, all the way to uh, our, our Ion Reporter, which is a cloud-based system. So with that entire workflow, you can generate your variants, which now live um, in, an, in, an, in a, in a cloud-based environment that you can access at any time. What we're also offering with the Ion S5 system is the uh, Smart Start program, which is a, kind of a program set up designed to get a customer up and running as fast as they possibly can. And we offer with this bioinformatics support and also a, a curated uh, workflow for your application right from the very start so you can begin the process of getting your scientific uh, question answered immediately. So for a clinical research lab um, that doesn't want to store data on the cloud, what options do we offer? We offer an um, uh, Ion Reporter server as a standalone instrument which will sit right next to your server, um, your uh, torrent server, and all of your data can be stored on that as well. So the marketing material all say um, the S5 system takes about less than 15 minutes to set up. So when you set it up, how long did you take? It, it literally takes about five minutes of hands-on time to get this instrument set up. It is just plug and play. Your cartridge goes in, you attach your bottle, put your chip in, hit go, and that's pretty much all it takes to run this instrument. That's great. If you want to learn more about the Ion S5 system or Ampliseq panels, go to thermofisher.com slash Ion S5.